HIFFIG Travel Channel offers DIY travel video guides for more than 25 cities in Asia, US, and Canada. If you like this video, then subscribe, give us a thumbs up, or a comment. Welcome to HIFFIG's travel guide series on Dubai, United Arab Emirates. In this video, we'll share our experience with the Dubai Gold Souk. Looking for gold? Our guide will help you navigate through the labyrinth of the Dubai Gold Souk in Old Dubai. In Old Dubai, souks or markets are organized into sections by what they sell, like spices and gold. The Dubai Gold Souk is located in the Deir era of Dubai, which is the older part of Dubai. The Dubai Gold Souk is one of the most popular souks in Dubai. The Dubai Gold Market is open daily from 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. Saturday through Thursday. FYI, many stores are closed from 1 p.m. through 4 p.m. On Fridays, the Gold Souk is open from 4 p.m. to 10 p.m. The Gold Souk is busiest during the evening hours. A convenient and fast way to get to the Gold Souk is to take the Dubai Metro Green Line. Exit the Dubai Green Line at Al Ras Metro Station. Walk about 10 minutes to the Dubai Gold Souk. Head northeast on Al Khor Street towards Al Baladia Street. The Dubai Metro Green Line runs Saturday through Wednesday, 5.50 a.m. to 12 a.m. and on Thursdays from 5.50 a.m. to 1 a.m. and on Friday, 1 p.m. to 1 a.m. For more information about the Dubai Metro, watch our video on Dubai Local Transportation on hipfig.com. The Big Bus and Sightseeing Hop On Hop Off Bus Tours both have stops at the Gold Souk. You can always take a taxi to the Dubai Gold Souk or you can take the Dubai Arte buses which are also available to the Gold Souk. Please check on the Dubai Arte bus website for specific directions. We took the big bus, hop on, hop off bus tour to the Gold Souk in Dubai, also known as the Dubai Gold Market, after a visit to the Dubai Fort. We had a Gold Dubai Volte Traction Card, which offers discount deals, which included a one day tour of Dubai on the big bus. We have added the link on our website, hipfig.com, for your convenience. Once we exited the big bus, we walked about 7 to 10 minutes into the main area of the Dubai Gold Market. At the entrance, you will see a sign that says Dubai City of Gold. When we arrived, the amount of gold that was displayed in the shops was so shiny that we felt we needed sunglasses. On both sides of the covered walkway, merchants displayed extravagant gold pieces of jewelry. I even saw a gold breastplate. The Gold Souk walkway seems endless as it twists and turns and at every bend there are more shops of gold. On occasion, someone will approach you to go to their shop to buy gold watches or designer bags. We recommend politely saying no. They can be persistent, but just continue to walk to avoid scams and fakes. You'll find 24, 22, 21, and 18 karat gold. They're priced by weight according to the market price but the design work is an extra fee. It's a good idea to know the market price of gold in the carat weight you are looking for so that you can negotiate accordingly. The stores will have the gold rate per carat posted in and outside their stores. Since these stores are regularly monitored by the government, the gold rate will be the same in any store you go in the gold souk. This gold weight price is generally non-negotiable. You can, however, negotiate the price on the make work, which is the design charge. The more detailed the design, the higher the price will be. Shop around and take your time when making a purchase. Many shops accept credit cards, but are willing to reduce their prices further for cash. I personally enjoy this part of the city as I feel it's more authentic and local than the modern buildings and malls of downtown Dubai and Jumeirah. Even if you don't intend to buy any gold, Dubai Gold Souk is a must visit when in Dubai. 
When else will you be surrounded by so much gold in your life? Happy travels! Go to hipfig.com for more information or go to our HipFig Travel Channel on YouTube and be sure to subscribe for regular updates.